Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Aries. This is for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is the singles reading. Okay, we're just going to see what do we got for singles. This is just a message from my guides for you. This may or may not be for you. Um, we're just going to see what comes up. You're single, you're Aries in some way. Okay, this is what we got for Aries. Well, I guess we're going to have to take that one, aren't we? Let me just zoom this out a little bit as it came a flying. So we were gonna get, we're gonna, we're gonna, I was gonna wait for one to flip or I was gonna pull it like I do and take the one on the bottom. Since we've stopped here, we're gonna stop right here. We're gonna take this one, we're gonna look at the bottom. So let's see what we have for Aries. Free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. You guys have been working on release for a very long time. You have. So it is, I mean, you think about Aries control. It is time. It's time to take back control of your life. Break free from your li limitations. Step outside of the box. Ste step outside of the cage. You are a free spirit. It's time to break free. It's time to spread your wings. It's time to fly. See, that's a unicorn. It's very magical. You, you can do whatever you want. Why don't you... Um, you know, you think about unicorns, they're about fantasy. Maybe maybe it's time to, you know, get some of those fantasies fulfilled. I mean, you got to step outside of the barrier. Open yourself up, Aries. Please, this is what this card says. It's time. Maybe, maybe you have been lying to yourself and I know a lot of you don't want to hear that I mean we all do it deception deception someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship we got three people in this card and every one of them has a mask on so you need to be aware of what masks you are wearing yeah, I understand that other people are wearing them too. That's under I see that. Everybody sees it, trust me, they do. But somewhere in this picture, you may be wearing a mask as well. You may be hiding behind a mask. Maybe it's time to all gloves are off. Maybe it's time to take that mask off and show the world who you are. That's what I think this is. We're not taking this card. Codependency addictions are affecting your romantic life. Well, that's a message somebody needs to hear, right? Codependency. Somebody is being inhibited inhibited because of their codependency, an addiction of some sort, an obsession. Somebody could be obsessed to somebody and they need to break free. Somebody could not be seeing the truth. They could be lying because they got some sort of addictions that are hiding the truth. And this reading is for you, Aries. So don't point the finger at anybody else, okay? So, what do we have for Aries? Singles. Ooh. Oh, the world card reverse, feeling incomplete and empty inside. But, you know, this is about something needing to end. This is a, a journey, a chapter, a phase needing to end. But you fr your free will plays a part. So somebody is ho holding on to some unfinished business that is causing them to feel incomplete on the inside. And all they have to do is release it, break free, step outside. Five of Pentacles reversed. Oh, you've got a golden opportunity waiting for you, Aries. Come on now. This is a gift. This is seeing the light coming out of the darkness, coming out of that mentality. Somebody left you behind. Oh, my God. This is leaving somebody. Somebody was left behind. They were left behind. But now there's a big, huge opportunity here. But you're going to have to complete that phase, complete that chapter, complete that life lesson, whatever it is. It has to do with being true to yourself. Oh, my God. Walking away. Walking away from something that is emotionally 
unfulfilling, climbing that mountain, seeing the bigger opportunity. So I feel as though you guys have this big opportunity to leave. This is your opportunity to leave somebody or something that you know, has made you feel insecure. It's caused you to feel empty and lost. It's it's caused, you've been a victim of this circumstance for too long, whatever it is. This is passion. You have the power. Red is the color of power. You have the power. So singles, it feels as though you're very attractive at this time. People can see. You get, this is a new vision. This is a new approach, taking action. You're looking very good at this time. You're very, very attractive. People are highly attracted to you right now. You, you have the strength and the courage. People see that. People see your, it's almost like extravagance, okay? Very, very sexy. Page of Wands reversed. This is not good news. This is somebody who's very pessimistic, doubtful. Oh my God, the magician reversed. It's like you've given your power away. I can't, I can't make it up, okay? I would love to. I really would. Magician reversed. I mean, somebody that is not aware, this is not aware. You could be dealing with a very tricky, cunning individual who has you stuck, has you thinking that if you wait around, they will change. No, no. Singles, I think that, you know, you're, you're being very pessimistic. This, this night of, this night, this page of wands reverse, this is, this is a Debbie Downer. This is feeling negative, thinking negative, um, Afraid. This is unfair treatment. The justice reversed. This is deception. Nine of Wands. Perseverance. I really feel as though you guys are thinking that the harder you work, the harder you work, the easier it will be to not get hurt. It's like a way to protect yourself. I think you guys are burying yourself in your work. Or maybe you're burying yourself in yourself. You know what I mean? You're taking care of yourself. You're working on your health. You're working on your image. You're working on your, your attractiveness. You're working on your, your body. You're working on your uh, vibration. Okay, you're working on yourself. You are definitely working on yourself. But there is a feeling of being incomplete. So somebody here is feeling incomplete they were left behind they were left behind by another person and now they're really focusing on their business focusing on their you know maybe you're starting your own business or you're you're growing your business you're focusing on your money you're focused on your coin i feel as though you're not feeling very optimistic about you know love at this time because i feel like you were left behind you were ghosted or you were you were um, not treated fairly, right? You weren't treated very fairly. You were dealing with somebody who doesn't want to be held accountable for their actions. There may be somebody you may be dealing with some legal um, contracts right now that are that are taking up their time, that are causing somebody to not to not feel very good about getting in a relationship. I feel like we have somebody that is 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 stuck inside some sort of pen unable to break free because they're not it's like they just don't want to this you can fly whenever you're ready you can get the hell out of there it's obvious that you can but this is this is deceit deception okay the magician reverse and this is deception so i feel as though you're you may be afraid of um you maybe don't trust anybody you don't want to get in no third party situation now do you no, you don't. I feel like you're afraid of being duped. You're afraid of being tricked. You're afraid of being lied to. 
You may have been dealing with a Gemini in the past. Maybe you were dealing with Gemini. Could have been dealing with another uh, fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Could have been dealing with a Libra. Whoever you were dealing with, they ghosted you. And they, and they left you behind, which has made you feel like you can't trust anybody. And that's what we got going on here. So, what's coming in this week, though? Is there anything? I see that you guys are very sexy. Very sexy. And, you're, and people can see it. People are highly attracted to you. Um, oh, we got two. Four of Wands and, well, the Knight of Cups. So, this is the Knight of Cups and the Four of Wands. So, this is, this is somebody that probably, you may meet somebody spontaneously, singles. You could, this is a celebration, the Four of Wands. We all know what it is. It's a celebration. It could be an anniversary. could be anything. could be a picnic. This is an upcoming celebration where you could meet somebody that you have a romantic connection with, the Knight of Cups. So be prepared. You may meet somebody spontaneously. It's like this is this is an angel here, so this is this is angelically guided. Whoever this person is, um, they're probably ready for a commitment. Their heart is open. Their heart is ready. So you're going to have to be ready to to fly. You're going to have to be ready to take that leap. Okay, you're going to have to be ready to step outside of this pen that you have kept yourself in. I understand that you have been lied to and I understand that you were not treated fairly and I understand that you were left behind and somebody, you know, lied to you for sure. And I feel like you guys have been burying yourself in your work to fill the void. But I feel like there's something unexpected that is going to happen for somebody. Somebody's going to unexpectedly, you know, run into somebody that might give them butterflies or something like that might might you know be potential this could be potential so take a risk that's my advice step outside of your comfort zone you know there you may so somebody may have ghosted you and left you you know to fend for yourself and they left you with no closure whatever You know, don't let that hold you back from happiness because four of wands is happiness. There's an opportunity for you to find happiness if you can, you know, <laughs> let your guard down. Okay, let somebody in. Open the freaking gate. Open the gate. It's like that song Desperado. And I don't know if I told you about this. If you were, I know I told another sign, but that's what it is. Open the gate. Let somebody in because you're going to get somebody that could be this could be the opportunity that you can actually take to the bank this is a gift give this person a chance i think that you are going to be very surprised by an offer from somebody that <sighs> didn't lie to you okay this person didn't lie to you this person isn't the one that hurt you this person has something solid to offer you Give them a chance. I feel like this person is probably a water sign or another fire sign. So it's either another Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or a water sign, uh, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. This person is emotionally available and they can help you to heal if you allow it. And that is what I have. Good luck.